And we're back. Alright, long last time finally home. Thank God I can go inside again. Ally left war, so how did he leave the war? But I couldn't. I've never really had this situation before. Like usually when when a character dies, they'll leave the war, sure, but then they their successor inherits, but that doesn't seem like it should be the case for for administrative. Hmm. I'll look for a little longer and then I'm going to give up. I don't know how I'm able to leave a war, but where is this guy was, wherever he is. Well, hopefully there won't be any consequences for me getting pulled into this war. We'll see. I'm almost tempted to hire some mercenaries. Um, why do these cost zero? Must be the war leader to call allies, I see. Oh, they probably get paid based on war contribution. That's that's fair. already hired? I don't... I don't understand. Why are they commanded by me? Okay, I still can't call them in anyway. I really don't understand what's what's going on. If this is just a UI bug or what. I just need to start I need to start sieging these down, but I don't have enough troops. Yeah, I need at least 500. 
Oh, I have a thousand. Because of the Basilius' host. Shit. But my land is all occupied, so I can't raise troops. Okay. Please siege this down so that I can raise troops to help you. We're learning! We're learning things. Keen as a blade edge. Good beams, Kalistos, again. Sword clangs against my sword, will against will. The need for victory is all the novice sword fighter feels. For the masterful knight, Kalisto smiles as he slaps aside blows. I shake my assault, exhausted. Your hand knows the sword well, my lord, says the knight, as does your brother's. There's an art to your fury, something to nurture. But our foes tremble. An aspiring blade master. Excellent. Yeah, I want to see if um, we're still a powerful family. Nope. That's fine though. It's it's only us that is the only adult in the family, so that's inevitable. They don't have ticking war score, right? It's really just occupations. We lost two battles and we have a lot of occupations going against us. Okay. Please take back my land. I'm begging you, AI. Bad luck, Gregori Georgios. Do not escape my notice that the despicable Strategos Gregorios is a very superstitious man. He fears unlucky days, unlucky colors, unlucky animals, and even unlucky trees. Spotting the shadow of the wrong bird at the wrong time could send him into a panicky spiral for days. Well, stripped, well, a strict observation of his ritual seems to bring him a sense of immeasurable safety. A minimal detraction, deviation from it could have unpredictably large effects on his peace of mind. Effects I could take advantage of. Is my rival, yes, yes. Start a murder scheme. I'm gonna mess with his head. I do have a free slot. I'm I'm going to I'm going to try to murder him. Ooh. Really high chance of success. Excellent. How's this peasant rabble going? You send an ultimatum in one month. Great. Gabriella's been swayed. I'm going to switch my sway over to my bishop. Okay.
I mean, this peasant revolt is going to be tiny. Because there's, like, no control. Um... Peasants' lot is to serve their lord. Okay, it's bigger than I thought. Never mind. What happens if I lose this? Just increased autonomy in both counties. Prince depressed comes of age. Proud to see my son no longer as a child, but as an adult. Always the curious and knowledge-hungry ch eh, child. Prince depressed has shown an affinity for scholarship from an early age. His understanding of philosophical and theological and the theoretical works is impressive, and he often engages in debate with his former teachers. Even at such a young age, he can be heard quoting obscure passages to support new ideas and theories. They grow up fast. Wow, he is overall kind of terrible. Honestly. That's really unfortunate. But he does have a genius wife. Well, not a wife. Basilius Eurostios is dead. In Carnalis' supreme church amongst dignitaries and prelates, a new Basilius receives coronation rites. Hail Magistos, cried those assembled. By the grace of Christ, faithful Basilius and autocrator of the Romans, the Comenenos forever Augustios. Well, other than being a Hashishia, he, he seems and vengeful. Diligent and ambitious and young? I mean, this could be a great Basilius, actually. I'm going to support him publicly despite this war. It's a well-known fact that cor all the courtiers will scheme and plot, but I may be able to use this to my advantage. If I can keep my courtiers suspicious of each other and distracted with infighting, they will not have the time or resources to scheme against me. We begin spreading rumors at once. Place some spies among them to be safe. I'm going to spread rumors. It works. Excellent. Many are the families of noble roots and dignity among the citizens of the Byzantine Empire. Very few, however, sit at the table of the Basilius, sharing in the responsibilities and honors of steering the ship of state. Few have real power, but today House Kuma is among them. Did stream freeze for anyone else? Oh no! I hope not. Let me see here. Try refreshing if if you can hear me. It was momentary. Okay. Yeah, I don't think it's anything on my end. There's... I've had a little bit of drop frames so far, but um, that's not network. But those aren't network frames, so it should be... I don't know. 
There's a new name among the magnates of the Byzantine Empire. The Malassa family has gained the right to be considered part of the nobility. Through corruption, intrigue, or actual worth, that I can't say. Doesn't matter, I'm sure they won't amount to more than a grain of sand, ready to be swept away by the turbulent winds of history and the inoxorable advance of House Kuma. Provincials. Oh, she's Norwegian. Neat. The governoress. Where's your hunt? I'm not traveling up there right now. Please march over here and kill my peasants. So I can help you in your war. Two of my agents, Strategista Antha and Velislav, seem to have found a common cause in our plan beyond the basic goal. Impressed by his compatriots' compatriots' skill with the wisdom, reading, and general knowledge required to challenge status, Vitislav has taken to studying what Agatha does differently to himself in hopes of improving his own skills. Harmless enough in theory, but it doesn't help our overall goal. That energy into the plan. Murder scheme is going quite nicely. The challenge scheme less so. We'll see. Oh, you're really going to unsiege my capital and let the peasants... See? Okay, that's fine. At least you're unseaging, finally. Like, I can raise an army and, and take care of the peasants at this rate. That's fine. Intrigue perk available. Oh, and arrange betrothal. I'm going to marry my niece. Sure. Alicia Volcania. It's her ugly borders. Oh, we'll, we'll ally them. She's not part of our dynasty, so I don't ma I don't care too much. Byzantine candidacy harmed. Confusion. Did my allies join that. Twists and faints. Turns of fate have not always been to my advantage. God knows I was cursed the day I met Stratikeo, Strat, Strategos Adrianos. Today, however, that curse has been lifted. Fate has smiled upon me and brought that chattering swain to his grave. Challenge scheme ends. Following the death sentence of a lowly thief, I asked my son Starbucks what he thought. He claimed he had learned a lesson about not reaching for more than one can handle. Uh, 
We are temperate, so overreaching can be terribly dangerous. We'll, we'll encourage our son to be more like us. Oh, they gained more peasants because they want a siege. Shit. That really sucks. Thanks for the hydrate and stretch. The existence of my plot to murder Strakaos Gregorios has been discovered. While my involvement is not yet known, this will make it a lot more difficult to bring my plans to fruition. Shit. Mm -hmm. I'll take a few more breaches before I just cancel the scheme altogether. My daughter Chai has just finished a lesson held by Eostia on the management of treasury and the gold herein. But it seems only the bits mentioning gold have stuck. Now she's levying small taxes from all the servants she can chase down, much to their collective annoyances. Nothing's more important than gold, child. I'm really fortunate that I'm afforded a chance to plan this scheme with my brother and friend Americano. We've gained advantages. Excellent. Gre Gregorios' changes countermeasures. Reduce chance for murder in similar schemes. Okay. Um... I'm just going to cancel the murder. This is getting too risky at this point with the scheme exposed and the 100% countermeasures in place. I will politically scheme against him though. Is the right person, right? Yeah. Challenge his status, or I could just slander him. There we go. We've finished that siege. Oh, and I can start increasing control in the capital again. Or not again. I can start increasing control in the capital, period. The Book of Gouda Cheese comes of age. 
always the clever child who had proved time and time again over the course of his studies that he had natural affinity for careful planning and more than a little misdirection. He now knows a lot of ways to get what he wants, and more importantly, he's highly aware of the political implications of those wants. See, this is an excellent character. Why are you still betrothed and not married? Because we're at war with the Basilius. That's a good reason. I like her. Callous, stubborn, but temperate. Stubborn, humble, generous. Let's go with this one. want to be here. This is a bit dangerous. We could go to- oh. Walk through Aeonia relieve, reveals something deeply unpleasant. A plague has arrived in the once thriving metropolis. The lumpy skin of the disease is bright red and painful to the touch. They sweat even in the cold and they have the look of a leper in their eyes. Already people are calling this affliction Messenian boils and it's happening in my own doorstep. While numbers remain low, it's only a matter of time until it spreads further. Summon the physician. A soft purchase best. What are we looking at, though? Oh, it's, it's not spread very far at all. Yeah, minor plague, that's fine. Guardian for Creamer. Um, sure, let's train her in Marshall, I guess. Intrigue. Let's train her in Marshall. Pardon my wet nurse. I don't know why I didn't do that sooner. Let's see, a blade master. What does blade master give us again? Seek a worthy successor. Never mind. Blade master gives nothing. Oh, Aspiring Blade Master trait experience. You and your primary heir may gain the Aspiring Blade Master trait every few years. Knight effectiveness. Not great, honestly. Not a really useful accolade, to be fair. That's okay. Early prevention success, mild epidemic prevention. My priest has passed away. I'm just going to attach over here. My new priest sucks. Cool.
rumors about the book of gouda cheese there are foul rumors about your son i have traced them to a source my spy master pat's bundle of letters letters prove that americano has been trying to drag the book of gouda cheese's name through the mud he mocks the book of gouda cheese's character accusing him of sin shocking sinful behavior People seriously think they can talk about my son like this. Spread even darker rumors so that all fear us. Offer Americano some coin to shut the fuck up. Find some ruffians to beat him up or distance myself. Without spreading darker rumors. Red gain? That's not that important. Hey bro, here's 20 bucks. Cut it out. In controlling the narrative. Ooh. Americano is quiet and everyone is happy. Ooh, my slander scheme is at 95%. Public discourse is ripe with the fruit of my subtle designs, my scandalous campaign of rumors, veiled accusations, and mindless gossip has caused a deep shift in sentiment towards Strategos Georgios. His reputation lies in tatters. A fine figure is so easily stripped of all gilding, so eagerly soiled by the words in the minds of others. Gregorius knows of my involvement, but it matters little. It is far too late now. The damage to his reputation is done. Lost opinion of me. Let's see about getting our sons on a theme. Let's see if we can get Gouda a 28 for Gouda versus 96 for French Depressed. So Gouda, we're going to put Gouda in front of line in Philippopolis. He is in poor health as well. I'm going to boost French Depressed to the top. No, not for 400. Never mind. I want to get a theme for French Depressed. Is he in line to anything? No. Well, here we go, Thessalonica. It's not heavily contested. Put him in line. Because that's a, at least a wealthy... Um, wealthy province. It is my sister-in-law, Perinthia, that's plotting to kill my courtier. That swamp-dwelling fiend. That's cute. I 
thought I was already moving. Okay, whatever. Heir is in line to inherit titles. Yes, yes. Still don't have very much prestige. And we're bleeding money. A well, level of influence. I forgot levels are a thing. Excellent. Gonna make our schemes a little easier. Time of the Kuma has come. Again. Let's see if we can't challenge him again. New governance issue. Rampant bandits. Done this before, I think. I read the reports again. Bandits, to whom my law-abiding taxpayers are but fat sheep for the shearing. And indeed, the rough outlaws have put my people to the blade. Villagers terrorized caravans lost. A particularly nasty group of the cutthroats have established a firm foothold in the hears in the hills near Pergamon. Until they are flushed out, the region will remain uncontrollable. Gather contingent of the soldiers we leave at once. We don't need the mercenary guards anymore. I will bring the hill uh, the mountaineer though. Vulnerable to plague. Dodecopolis. Since the age of Homer, when the Aeolian and Ionian colonists disembarked among the western coast of Anatolia, the twelve cities of the Anatolian coast, the Dodecopolis, have stood as shining beacons of civilization and human development. Build crop fields. Huh. Are you also a Dodecopolis? Interesting. The governor is actively persecuting and disbanding the local net of tunnels and hidden safe houses. For control growth, lower popular opinion, rampant bandits, bandits running rampant, lack of sheriffs, increased economy, at risk of plague. Aeolus gains smuggling ring. Mm. First wave was a bust. Damn. The denizens of Pergamon gladly lend us right to the mouth of the wolf's den. The encampment of outlaws lies just beyond, obscured by brush and broken terrain. From what I hear, I judge these foes to be nomadic warriors, tough folk living on the fringes of settled society. So flush on the wealth of my land that they've turned their raiding foray into an extended stay. The foe is not yet alerted to my posse's presence. We have the opportunity to strike however we see fit. They're all about the same chance. 
Luring them into a trap could save us a lot of trouble. Mine is a most cunning trap. Half-naked young soldier with stolen dinner in hand races back towards us. The outlaws, the half-wits, chase right after. We leap from hiding, howling the terrified foe recognize their mistake, and we fall upon them. Moments from death, the nomads surrender to my troops. This group of criminals is rendered harmless, helpless. They're at my mercy. Could pardon their crimes. Give me piety. Or offer them honest coin for a living. This character has recru recruited a number of former bandits as mercenaries, despite what others may think. Lord prestige. More mi less men-at-arms maintenance. Knight effectiveness, men-at-arms damage. Lord popular opinion. Huh. I'm going to hire them. We're hurting for money right now and we're in the middle of a war. This is actually going to save us a little cash. This other war... Antiochian expansion of the county of Atab. Oh, we're about to get sieged by our liege. I want this war to be over. Will you guys just swear a white peace, please? It's come to my attention, my lord, that you might be in need of some of my talents. My new acquaintance, Gila Comagon, approaches me smiling. If my, if my services could be of use, please do not hesitate to request them. Leech Siege, Siege Leech. Siege, Siege Leech, Siege Leech, Leech Siege. We did this joke uh, last stream. Uh, I could use someone. I might have some use for you. Use someone like you. I remember the day when my son Starbucks was born to my wife, Gre Gregoria, my charming son. Memories like these bring me comfort. No matter what happens, I know my family is there for me, and that House Kuma stands strong. Persevering with sword in hand, I whisper under my breath. Coffee use, liege siege, leech seed. I treasure the thought or Starbucks deserves a gift for his loyalty. I can't afford that right now. We'll investigate. Uh, she would never disrespect the sanctity of our marriage. Investigate this myself. You might be a governor latte, but you're also a vile sycophant. The unprovoked anger expressed when my son and heir French depressed came as a complete surprise. Been under a lot of stress lately, but to behave like this. I'm gonna stand my army down. I cannot afford. No! Kuma sword! I wanna leave this war. Wait, am I part of a faction? Not possible to leave a faction that's at war. Okay. I was hoping. I was hoping that's how I get out of it. Doesn't need a guardian for Venti. 
a learning education. Convert her to Greek. Air is in line for titles. My steward has died. Uh, Mayor Gabriella, you only have five stewardship, but I'm going to make you my steward. Uh, so that I can make Mayor Polyphoros. my uh, marshal a promote cultural acceptance might be a good use of my Lyphora well, still doesn't like me He's ambitious, mostly, in cultural acceptance. Alright, come on. Let's, uh, let's work with me here. Just, just lose this battle. Get into a fight, lose it. Good job, you're gonna lose. 100%, there we go. Been captured and detained against my will by Basilios Ma Megius. Megistos. Hope this does not last. Ah. And I've been stripped of my title. I did nothing wrong. Let's find secrets in Constantinople. Train commanders. Except for all the murder plots. I mean, I inherited the war. Also, I never actually killed anybody. There was a commotion among the children today. CR was attempting to preach among her fellow youngsters and became the target of a small fight. Chai intervened and did what she could to protect her. Chai is greedy and brave. Her back down from a challenge. Orios lost a title. My son didn't gain a title, did he? No. What is he in line for again? A Thessalonica, not. I guess he wasn't in, in line for this title. Unraised men-at-arms expenses. Unraised men-at-arms? Really? Why do we still have men-at-arms? I thought we... I thought they would have gotten inherited with the... Might be some bugs in this version of the game, to be quite honest. Unless I'm misunderstanding something.
To spend my day separated from all the ones I love is a cruel punishment. I find myself seeking out any source of comfort and companionship I find, but they are few. The only thing that gets me through the long days is my connection with Governoress Gubana. I'll yet find someone who's willing to talk to me or she's my one source of friendship. Having friends is nice. Do I? I don't need the stress loss, so yeah. A lot of new families being created. Son is losing Opskion. I'm not going to spend that much influence. Oh, I'm still losing money. Betrothed can marry. Let's do that. Oh, I'm in line for Philippopolis. It's nice. You've been imprisoned. I understand. Thank you. Some of these actually have a chance of requesting, which is really interesting. Transylvanian Alps? Really? Oh. Yeah. I guess so. Um... I could spend influence to go free. I'm gonna try not to yet though. Who's my regent? Americano? He's selfless, which is good. Uh, Phil Coffers. While well, performing your duties as my spy master, Lothier has uncovered a secret held by my fellow vassal, Stephanos. There's evidence that he may be participating in secret rituals. What other purpose would there be for something like that but to commune with evil spirits? Possibly consorting with demons. The one who holds Venice. You're definitely blackmailing him. Every day spent as a prisoner of the Basilios is another day that my carefully laid plans slip further from my grasp. The true punishment is not the bodily confinement I find myself under, it's being so incapacitated. Another bus, another raid in 24 minutes. Aw oh, man. Gains critical stress because you're ambitious. I could contest his appointment with a hook. I 
don't even need the hook. Okay, I am going to ransom myself for influence. My routine is always the same as morning turns to day turns to night. The nauseating spell smell of spoiling food helps, hangs heavy in the air. When do the pile of plates grow so high? How many meals have I missed? Getting increasingly difficult to keep up any sense of normality. Ads, thank you. In apathetic and famished. I'm just going to take the stress here. Because we will get out eventually. Okay, I'm going to run ads here. Everybody, take a minute and get up and stretch your legs, rest your eyes, uh, make some, get some water, make some coffee, make a sandwich. Take care of your meat vessel. You only get one of them, and it's important for that reason alone. We'll be back in three minutes, and I will see you then. Be right back. 